You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and check it out. We have the Yummy Nummies Mini Kitchen Magic Soda Shop Maker Play Set. And look at that. I got to set this whole thing up and make six flavors of soda. I could also make it fizzy. Look at that. Tiny bubbles bursting with flavor. Swirl straws actually work. Make your own bubbly drinks. Lots of bubbling going on. Make enjoy. All right. Same thing on that side, and this kind of tells you everything that's included. Your nutritional facts, all the food is made in the USA. It is a blip toys, and right here again, look. Dispense your drink, choose your bubble flavor, and then make your fizz drink. It looks like fun. I think I, uh, I think I want to at least get it out of the box for you right now. Let's do that, and then we can see. Sometimes it's fun for, well, it's fun for me to open boxes, so hopefully it's fun for you to see everything dump out on the table. Okay, nothing's dumping yet. Ooh, look at that. That's really cool. And that's all that's in the box, so let's get into this. Okay, so there's that tray. That tray was on the box. It showed all the flavors in there. Here's our packets. All your cute little squeezers, which looks like they go in here. Oh, look at that. All right, so it looks like I'm going to have them um, to do some washing, so I'll wash the pieces, and then uh, I'll come back and have it all organized for you on my nice little play mat, see? So there's all my steps, so when I come back, I will get started with you. Here we go, this is everything that is in the box. Now I have it all organized. Now down here in front, I have the four main flavors, and each flavor comes with a little bottle that's gonna go in this upper section here when you're ready. So I'll show you each one. This is blue raspberry. There's a little picture on it. See, blue raspberry. So I'll set that off to the side. And then bubblegum. It's got little bubbles. Okay. And then strawberry. Okay, there's your strawberry. And on the end is cola. And that's got little bubbles and it's brown. And then your fifth and sixth flavors are combination flavors. And you'll see this one is cola and strawberry. That's going to give you a new flavor. And then this one here is bubblegum and blue raspberry. So it's matching up the pictures. And then this is your vanilla base. Now this gets mixed in the middle here because you're going to take your flavoring. And well, this is what I think you're going to do. I haven't done it yet. And then mix it with your vanilla base and then put in the fizz. So the end one is the fizz. Okay, so those are all off to the side. And then you have your tray for your six flavors. A blue spoon and then your purple uh, scoop and then let me move this forward a little bit so you can see so you have three cups with this so I'll move them all here okay three cups and then f uh, three straws a pink a yellow and a blue okay and they're twisty straws I'll move those we don't need those till the end we'll move this out of the way now this actually does come apart this comes off this comes off this actually pulls out because I rinsed it and dried it and this is for a dry ingredient, so you're kind of putting it in there and turning it, and then the dry ingredient drops out of there, and then you're dispensing your liquid here with this, and the little bottle's up here, and of course that was the straw compartment. This actually comes off too, so you could totally take it apart. You can see it's still a little wet because I didn't wash it out. And that is my mini soda shop, so when I come back, I will start mixing my flavors. All right, here we go. My packets are ready. I have them in order, just so I was set. And then, as you can see, I have my bottles up here. And you can see now why the little circle was there. So each flavor is represented and easy to see. And then, now the first thing is to fill each one, trays one through six, with water. So here we go to the fill line. One, two, Three, it's getting heavy. Four, starting to bend. Five, all right, and then six. I'm gonna have to do each flavor and mix it. So, so mix in one scoop of blue raspberry powder into the first tray. So let me let me see how I want to do this. I don't want lumps, so I'm gonna. 
tap and then mix. And it says mix well, so what I might do is get them all set and then mix them even better. It's hard to mix. Okay, yeah, see it's stuck here, so you want to probably let it sit and settle for a little bit before you actually get started. So I'll have to now move on to the second one. So that is bubblegum. Alright, let me get this out, and I will have to clean that, if you know what I mean. I'm just going to dump it in because it didn't seem like it mattered. That's probably what I should do, is just get them all in there and then come back and mix them all. Alright, and then the next one is strawberry. And the last one is cola. Now look, I've showed it in the past now. There's a lot extra in there. So this is one scoop. There's probably three, four scoops in there still. So there's plenty to do. Okay, and then the last two trays are the combos. So let me get that out of there. Okay, so now the combos. Ooh, look, at got too much on there. I'll mix them all better in a second once I get all my flavors in there. All right, and combo number one was bubblegum, half a scoop, and then a half a scoop of blue raspberry. So that goes in the last, the second to last tray. There's even a line on the scoop for the half mark. Half. Half. And then the last one is strawberry and cola. Half scoop of each. Look at those cool colors. Okay. Now I will mix these. I'll do some for you now, and then I'll just come back so you see after they're mixed better. They kind of need to settle and mix and settle and mix and then probably break apart in the water, so it might take a little time. I'll just do this one and I'll come back. Oh, look at that. That's cool. I'm going to want to let these just melt a little in the water. This tray was dented just lightly, so. Okay, I'm going to let these sit. Mix them all. These are already starting to get a little darker. So when I come back, I will do the next step, which is the vanilla base. I'll be right back. So the next step is getting your droppers filled. And I did spend a little bit more time trying to get as much of the lumps out as I can. And I've just been squishing and mixing and squishing and mixing. And you can just tell it has changed consistency. Consistency, most of them have no lumps in them at all. So that's what I did. And yes, I'm mixing flavors, but not that much. So here is the blue blair blueberry. It's the blueberry. Going to have to be careful putting those in. Let's just see without touching the label there. Okay, so you can get it up to the label area. So that's about how much goes in. And we'll carefully put this one back on without trying to squeeze. And the next one, we'll just go right down the line here. Ooh, I touched my label. Let me wipe that off with a little rag. Okay.
and then the cola. See if I can get a little more in there. Hmm. Let me squish it all the way. All the air out. There we go. And the combo flavor. And you've got plenty, see? So once you've tried a flavor, you can take more out of your trays. So just set those off to the side. So that's what I'm going to do. Carefully set those off to the side. Okay, so the next step now is to fill this with water. There is a line. Uh, you can kind of see it right back here and pointing to it of water. Here we go. The next step, the vanilla base. Okay. And then three scoops. Let me just refresh my memory here. Fill the playset tank with water up to the fill line. Open the vanilla base. Add three scoops of powder and mix well. You almost just kind of want to put the three scoops in something. That's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to take one of my cups. I'm going to put three scoops in a cup. Here I am over here. I'll clean it out, but I just want to do that. So when I'm pouring it in, I'm mixing it. Two. And three. There we go. And now that goes in this top section. So I kind of want to mix and pour at the same time see if this lumps up or not and there's plenty in the bag and there's a nice smell to it So it is changing the water just slightly off-white. And the last of it. There we go. I'll wipe that cup out. So it says mix well. What do you think well is? Well, well, that's a deep subject, right? Did anybody say that? So the last step is the fizzy packet. Pour three scoops of powder into the playset container marked fizz. I think it is very important to make sure everything is mixed well. Okay, so I will put my fizz in, make sure it's set in the off position right there. Three scoops of fizz. And you've got a lot of fizz. One, two, and it looks like there's at least another three to six scoops, probably six or more scoops in there. So fizz is set. All right, I am ready. So I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna mix this just a little bit more and then I'm gonna make my first drink. All right, my soda shop is now open for business. It says to fill the cup with vanilla drink about half full. Okay, so let's pull this down and let her fill. Okay, and then put in your flavoring. Step number two, squish all that in there. Want all that blueberry in there. Mmm. Was it blue raspberry? Yeah, blue raspberry. Okay. And then, oh, look at it. It's starting to almost turn jelly in there. And then the last one is this, the little fizz powder. Go all the way around, it says, until it comes out. Okay, there you go. Ooh, look at that. It started fizzing. Did you see? Let's just check it out. I'm just doing a check out. Yeah, look at that. It's now turned into like a jelly in there. Then it says, eat it and enjoy. So let's try this first flavor. 
I'll try a straw, but I don't think I'll be able to use a straw because of the way this changed. Blue drink, blue straw. Here we go. Ooh. I taste it. It didn't get stuck on the straw, but let me finish this one. Mm, what does it remind me of? Almost like a high C kind of drink, but with fizz to it. Mm, all right, let's do another one. Let's try, so that one I need to wash. Let's try the next flavor, so halfway. Now you can mix and match, remember? You don't have to do any one flavor. Yeah, look at that. It turns out like little wormies in there. Hmm. And then the powder. Turn again till it comes out. Ooh, look at the fizz. The next one, I'll give you a close up of all that. See? All right, let's taste this one. Mmm. I like the fizz. All right. Let's try number three. And I'll wash everything and try the other ones. Okay. Next, to squish it from here. Then bring it over to here. And I will bring you right into that operation there so you can see it. Okay, here we go. See the fizzing action in there now? Let's do a little more fizzing action. Oh yeah, look at that. And then you put your little straw in. There's a nice little drink. All right, so I'm gonna taste this one. This is the strawberry, right? Tasty. I will be back. I'm going to wash my cups, and then I will come back with the next three flavors. All right, here we go. Now, I was looking at the box. It does say bubbles appear like magic, so I think it's supposed to be bubbles bursting with flavor. So you're supposed to drop it in and get the little bubbles, and then you eat those little bubbles as you drink. Here, let's go half a cup. I'll show you what I'm talking about. I know it doesn't look like half a cup, but... So then you just drop in, and then it turns into little bubbles. See? Watch. Okay, so that's what it's supposed to do. And now you have the little bubble flavors in there. And then you bring it over to your next department. But look, can you see them in there? I know, it's hard to see. Let me turn up the camera. It's zoomed in quite a bit. They are floating in there. Let me get my straw so you see what I mean. It's like the little candy eggs. Here, let me zoom back a little bit. I'm too close and it's having a hard time focusing. So it's like the little eggs from the other sets. So that's what it's supposed to do. Now I understand it. So let's add the fizz. Let's see if we can add the fizz this way and you can get a better look at it. Because it's pretty neat how it does fizz up. How's that? Here we go, fizz going in. Ooh, fizz not going in, I need to move my fizz. Here we go, now we're gonna get some good fizz. Look at that. So that is the bubbles and the fizz, and now you can see the bubbles at the top, right? Okay, so this is the cola one. I know it's really close, but... And this one does smell like cola. And you get the bursting bubbles. Here we go. 
Ooh, I like that one the best so far. All right, so now let's do one of the combination ones. Okay, no more close-ups, sorry. There's the whole thing. Okay, and then make some bubbles. Oops. Oops. Ooh. I'm glad I did that. Looks like my fizz needs to be filled up a little. All right, here we go. Oh, now you can really see my little eggs in there. Let's see if we can top down. That one's perfect to kind of show you. See that in there now? Those are your flavor bubbles. And now, my fizz. So this is the combination flavor, which is turned the wrong way. Okay, I fixed the wall. They got moved around. Okay, so now they're all straight. And let's try this one now. See, if you try it with the straw, it's not going to get the little flavor bubbles. You get the vanilla, and then you just have to drink it. Mm. Ooh, that one has a little sourness to it. Last one. Here we go. I was running out, but I think that's enough to give me some fizz. Now that one lumped up, see, so sometimes I guess it can lump up depending on how you pour it in, so watch how you pour it in. Let's try this last one here. So this is the combination of cola and strawberry. So the flavor is not very strong. I mean, it's good. You know what I'm saying is it's not overly sweet or overbearing. It's good. You can taste the flavor. So what do you think? I originally had these turn wrong when I put them back in, but now they are just right. So now that makes sense on how this works. And it tastes good, and I like it, and it's fun. And now we know the little bubbles bursting with flavor. Overall, I would say, a fun set. Now look at all the other flavorings I still have. So you can keep going and making more sodas. And thanks for watching. Hope you like this set. It was the Yummy Nummies Mini Kitchen Magic Soda Shop Maker Play Set. And if you want to see all the other Yummy Nummies I've done, look in the description. We'll have a playlist there. Now remember, we have every single set, so every week... Every week, a new one comes out, and there's probably a good six or seven more. And thanks for watching and supporting Lucky Penny Shop. I hope you enjoyed this set and watching the video, and we appreciate it. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching.